just want to quickly show you who I'm with right now. You guys no, recognize no, look who that? I'm with right now. Look who I'm with. <laughs> look who I'm with. Truck and Todd. Morning, everybody. Getting all of my stuff together here in the hotel room in Louisville, Kentucky. Today's the day we're going to Matt's. We'll be at the House Products booth for most of the day and also walking around finding some of you guys and finding some of my friends to say hi to. We're only here for today. Tomorrow morning I fly back home. But it's gonna be a lot of fun. Today's shout out goes to our good friends at Howes. If you want to learn more about the great people that I'm going to be spending time with here at Matt's, go to their website down below at Howes Products. You can find it in the description of my video. I think I'm ready to go. Oh, I didn't make my bed. Shame. Shame, Josh. Shame. Meh. Good enough. We're ready to go. I'm bringing my Sony a7C to the show today. Very excited. This is a, an amazing camera. It's a little bit bulky, so I don't use it on every day. But it's gonna be fun today. Good morning, Louisville. I even cleaned my shoes for this. All right. Big day. morning. I'm meeting the guys from house downstairs for breakfast. Gotta start the day off right. It's gonna be a long day, but it's gonna go by very quick. Good morning. Oh, you brought the big rig. Yeah, oh, we brought the good one. No messing around today. Absolutely. So this is Rich from House. Hey. He's the guy who brought me down here. Yes. Glad to have you. We're here to have a nice little breakfast before we head down to the show. This is our ride. Yeah. Oh. This thing's huge. So this is our ride to the show. Look at this. Wow. Touch screen in the back. Yeah, yeah. Real Yeah, I know. It's not letting me do it. I think it's in. It's locked. Just 
arrived to our house booth here, and here's our house team. You guys want to meet Mr. House himself? How's it going? It's going. Yeah. And we're here. You guys excited to be here? You're excited You're to be here in Abby. America. Happy yeah. Yeah. Happy to be here. <laughs> Always a great show. Looking forward to it. So it would have been wonderful to have you all weekend. I'm doing that. would have been, you know, yeah. No, you could have manned this with me. So we'll, we, we forgot the keys. They have to go back. Oh, so no. <laughs> so it's going to be a little tight. Okay. But we'll stock all that. And it'll, it'll, your video will be much better later today. Oh, yeah. With people milling about, too. You know, it'll look busy. And, okay. So Rich here was just telling me this is where my video. The Hall of Fame is going to be playing all day. If you guys were at the show and you swung by, you probably saw it here. This case is going to be all filled up. And my face is going to be playing on these screens. So I'm only here for today. Uh, tomorrow is my son's birthday. So I'm going to be running back for his birthday, but this booth will still be running throughout the whole weekend. And you'll be able to see the video they put together for me right here. So we just finished an interview with Red Eye Radio. It might be live by the time you guys see this already. Trucking's best source of information. Thank you. All right. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you. Good luck. See ya. So this is the entry hall where everybody is uh, scrambling to get in. Organized chaos. It's, uh, these lines will help the door at times. Yikes. Yeah, there's a lot of people. And this is the Thursday, so I'm guessing the Friday and the Saturday would be would be even more intense. Probably tomorrow will be one of the busiest days. So next is Todd, oh, I'm sorry. That's okay. Todd Dills from Overdrive. Okay. And you have a, a backstory with them, right? They, they were yeah. the first to cover you, right? Yeah. yeah. So we're out here checking out the Women in Trucking trailer. I hear it's something to see. We got our own tour guide.
controls and everything. This is expert mode. That guy's facing the wrong way. <laughs> So that's got to be him. Hey, hey. We're just oh getting ready to start. I'd like to send a big shout out to me and uh, oh yeah, thank you, man. Man, again, I got a hot rod fired up this year. We're not kind of ready. I just want to quickly show you who I'm with right now. You guys no, recognize no, look who guy? I'm with right now. Look who I'm with. <laughs> Justice. You guys know him, you guys love him. Finally got to meet him. Hey everybody. Hey, this, just, guy, this, this guy's the best. Been We've been friends on Facebook and really supporting one another for, uh, for years now. Six, the first time years. we met actually was on the driver's line. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. yeah. A long time ago. So, uh, it's the first time we've got to meet in person, man. It's like, yeah. it's like oh, seeing a long lost brother. It's the first time we met. I caught him off guard. I sort of snuck in and surprised him. Yeah. He didn't know I was coming. But this is super cool. Great yeah. surprise, man. He's yeah. my favorite, one of my favorite country singers. He's my favorite Canadian truck driver. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that. Utah boy. While I'm here, he's walking around the back there. Van Brown. He's the owner of Bullsnot. He hasn't seen me here yet. He's busy, busy selling products. Oh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> he broke. How's it going? Just wow. Get on. Finally get to meet you in person. Hi, hey, everybody. This is the face behind Bullsnot. How's it going? Just wild. Yeah. We gotta see it from the master himself. Let's yeah, see this. What's this your... rocket smoke? Don't have a truck in here, but if it was a truck, that's the way it works. Oh yeah. That's nice. That's got some pretty good range. Mm -hmm. 15 feet. <laughs> I think you uh So it's been a busy day. There's been a lot of interviews. We just got off the Sirius XM radio. Just finished that up and we're headed to the hotel again. So cleaned up a little bit, then we're going out for supper. So they'll all be back here tomorrow and the next day yet. I'm headed home first thing in the morning, but it's been a lot of fun. I got these trucks all day and how clean they are, especially this guy right here. Incredible. I wish I had a little bit more time to walk around and explore, but uh, we had a tight schedule. Look at this truck. Look how clean that is. Alright, we're trying to find the exit.
sit down. <laughs> I need one of those. I need to start looking into what kind of APU I should get. Do any of you have any uh, recommendations? Let me know down below in the comment section. What would be the best APU? I'm looking into one maybe later this year or early next year, 2025. Oh, I need one of those too. Oh, one could spend lots and lots of money here. Oh, check this out. Stage, where all the extra food carts are. Up there somewhere, I don't know. So, Rob, did the first day go as well as you had hoped? I think so. It was yeah. pretty busy there. And, uh, definitely, if you haven't been by yet, people should. But, uh, hey, you'll be here another two days yet. Yeah. It's a lot of work setting that all up though, eh? It's a lot of work setting it up, it's a lot of work taking it down, but it's worth it. You get to see a lot of really good people that come by these. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I mean, you've got to see it. It's just massive. 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 And it's not just one building. Walking around here. Oh yeah. Yeah, you can't see it all in three days. I love the show. This is definitely the central for all truckers, I think. Trucker central. Yeah, if there's something trucking, you'll find it here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you're looking for. I've been very impressed. And uh, I want to give a did it go, big thank you. Did it that. go as good for you? That's the real question. It went even better. Awesome. You guys have been so nice to me. And I just want to say a special thank you to the Howes family for having me out here. And you guys have treated me so well. And had a lot of fun. We had a lot of fun, too. It's been an honor. And uh, honor glad to have you part of the Hall of Fame. Yeah, Looking go check it out. See where it goes. So it's uh, houseproducts.com slash H-O-F. You got it. Go and check it out. You can see me and all the other people that are in the Hall, hall of Fame as well. It's good stuff. Now we're gonna go get something to, something to eat. Do we know where we parked? Well, they're way in <laughs> front of us already. Do we know where we parked? <laughs> uh, what did I tell you about me? Yeah. <laughs> Very much like me. I, uh, I get lost easily, yeah. Oh, me too. Although I found that booth you were looking for. That's true. Yeah, we got to say hi to our friends there uh, at Van Brown. I've been wanting to meet him in person for years already, so that was cool. See, that's that's what these events are all about. It brings everybody in the industry all together under one roof. Yeah, a lot of players. Or several roofs. Yeah. Several roofs, yeah. Yes. <laughs> and, a, uh, and an entire stadium. Yeah. Don't forget that. The stadium. Ooh, Tony uh, Justice Tony is... Tony Justice is going to be playing in, yeah. Yeah, Tony Justice is going to be playing in the stadium tomorrow. I won't see it, but uh, maybe someone will broadcast it or something. I'll be able to watch it online. Let's see. I can, I can fill up some. <laughs> Here's the beast. The beast. This thing is huge. <laughs> oh. This is your starter truck right here. Okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I think you're in the front. Okay. I think you should be able to adjust it. Yeah, thank you, Warren. To there. Oh, that's okay. We definitely have to mess with the ambient oh, I lighting. Have. I did yesterday. He's got it all set. <laughs> yeah. No, it's all yours. Can you Check this out. Got some goodies from Van at Bullsnot. Um, I was so happy and excited that I got to see him yet. And Tony Justice too. Oh, I had a great day. So since I'm only here for the one day, like I've been saying, everything has just been crammed together into today. So there's so many more things I wanted to do. So many more people I wanted to say hi to. And I wanted to go explore a little bit, but you know, there's always next year. Maybe next year uh, we can come out and, <coughs> excuse me. Maybe next year we can come out and uh, spend the entire weekend, you know? Maybe I can bring Theo with and Britt and maybe we can make it a family trip. And we're in Louisville, Kentucky here. We have friends in Tennessee. Maybe we can go visit them right away too. And then if we're going to Tennessee, I mean, Disney World and Florida is just a hop, skip and a jump down the road. You may as well just go down there. You got the whole family with you, why not? The only thing is, in order for us to travel as a family, we need a bigger vehicle, right? Uh -huh. We have our terrain right now, which is a, a good vehicle. It's a good family vehicle. Love it, it's been totally reliable for us, we love it, but just with one kid and his stroller, 
we can't even take it to go grocery shopping because there's no room for groceries. And I know what you're thinking, right? First world problems. First world problem. I know. But you put a stroller in the back. You put his car seat on the back seat. Now you only have one seat in the back. You could pick up a few groceries. But if we do a big grocery shop or a Costco run, there's not enough space in there for our kid, his stroller, and all of his stuff, his diaper bag, everything that comes along with having a baby. And soon to be a toddler. Tomorrow he's going to be a toddler. It's his birthday. I've been telling everybody. I've been telling everybody who will listen about him. I'm so excited. Uh, but anyway, uh, rabbit trail there. Talk to me about my kid and I'll talk your ear off. But So we need a bit of a bigger vehicle to go on a road trip like that to be comfortable. So my wife and I, we've been not in the market yet. We're not thinking about buying vehicles now yet. But when we do, we, we've sort of put our sniffers out there and started kind of looking around, not serious, half serious, okay. We want to get a Yukon, a GMC Yukon XL. That's the vehicle we've decided that's the one we want. Now we have to figure out, okay, what year are we going to get? What year can we afford? What, uh, what works for us? It would be nice to have a new one because then you got warranty. I'm not going to replace my pickup truck anytime soon because uh, I want to make sure that my family has a safe vehicle first. So the way I'm tying this all into Matt's next year and our friends in Tennessee, our friends in Virginia, our friends down in Disney World, plus I'd like to go see Troy and Angie, my friends out in Washington State yet. Though that, that'd be a bit of a big loop to go to that coast. We'd have to make a separate trip for that. We would need a big, vehicle, a big enough vehicle that we can have us in there, our son, our kids, our dogs, because they have to come with us, all of our luggage, and still be comfortable. The GMC Yukon XL. I may just be dreaming, but hey, we're allowed to dream. We'll see what comes of it. But anyway, we uh, came by the hotel here just to get freshened up. We have a supper, a uh, fancy dinner coming up here with the house people. Can't say enough good things about them. They treated me so well while I've been here. And don't forget to go check out their site down below every one of my videos. There's a site down there. Uh, that specifically tracks from my channel then, then they can track the, the traffic from my YouTube channel here to their website. You can click the link down below. I'd really appreciate that if you go that route to get there and check out the Hall of Fame. We made it into the Hall of Fame. That's a huge honor. So we're at the River House restaurant on the river, literally just across the river from Ohio. We have this like private table here in our own little room. It's almost like having our own personal little restaurant. How's went, how's spoiled me quite a bit. I'm sitting at the head of the table here too for some reason. But everybody's been having a good time. And we're all just finishing up here right now. And we just had the greatest steak I have ever tasted in my life. A 16 ounce, what was it called again? It was a ribeye, a ribeye, a smoked ribeye. They smoked it for 16 hours, 13 hours. Highly recommend the River House, right? I would highly recommend this if you're ever in, I want to say Louisville, but I keep getting made fun of. I think the locals say Louisville. 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 There you go. That was good. Louisville. I was going to say, you always got to say it like you're about, you know, 24 beers deep. Yeah. Um, in Louisville. <laughs> But yeah, thanks very much for yeah. everything you've thank done you. for me. I just want to say thank you to the house team. This is everybody who's, uh, they treated me so well. They made me feel so special. And uh, you went above and beyond. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. Did you enjoy dinner? Oh, I absolutely enjoyed it. The best steak I've ever had in my life. I, very close, if not the best. Okay, I'll leave room for some other steaks I've had in the past. I've had some good steaks. I've had three drinks at Doma, so that's Exactly. Loosen everybody up a bit but yeah been having a lot of fun